Now on three, the Cleveland Catholic Diocese has a new bishop. He is the Most Reverend Edward Molesic, and he's coming here from Pennsylvania. Brandon Simmons tells us more about him and when he arrives. For the first time, we heard from the new leader of the Catholic Diocese of Cleveland. Pope Francis appointed Bishop Edward Molesic to the position. He currently holds the same role in Greensburg, Pennsylvania. His vision for Cleveland is straightforward. The vision that I have is simply is, is simple um, to, to, to communicate the gospel to people. The big question is how do you do that? For that, you can look to Molesic's past. In 2015, Molesic was made bishop of the Greensburg Diocese, where he's served the last five years, taking on the opioid epidemic by creating a task force in the church, tackling sexual abuse head on, and most recently, navigating a pandemic. The difficulties in the church today are the same everywhere. Probably in Cleveland, my guess is there's a lot of young people who are not attending mass or um, uh, drifting away from the practice of the faith. We, we need to address that. Molesic fills a vacancy left by the departure of now Archbishop Nelson Perez, who was the bishop in Cleveland for a short period of less than three years before being promoted. Molesic admits coming to Cleveland will be a challenge, leading nearly 700,000 Catholics across eight counties. The diocese is about five times larger than the diocese I'm coming from, so be patient with me. There will be a learning curve. I promise to do my best. I know I will make mistakes. Forgive me when I do. Known for his warm and relaxed leadership, Molesic will likely fit right in, officially taking over in Cleveland on September 14th. Give me some time to pack and make the transition from Greensburg to Cleveland and from the Steelers to the Browns. And can I at least bring one terrible towel with me for old time's sake? As you can see, he's really a down-to-earth kind of guy. His Episcopal motto is to serve the Lord with gladness, Russ, and he's already looking forward to doing that right here in Northeast Ohio. And Brandon, I don't know about you, but I'm not going to be the one to tell him he can't bring that towel here. <laughs> it's got to stay in Pennsylvania. Just don't do it, my friend. <laughs> Just trust me on that one. Brandon, thank you so much.